One of the most powerful church services that I ever did was about 10 years ago when I talked about God's favor. Usually, we are the ones that feel we are out of favor. I gave an affirmation to everyone that particular Sunday. Simple. I am in God's favor. I had them repeat it a hundred, two hundred times a day if necessary. A hundred times in the morning and a hundred times at night to remind them that God loves them, to remind them that God is with them, to remind them that God is their help in every need. I am in God's favor for this Saturday and this Sunday. Start your day with that 100 times. Count it off with your hand. I am in God's favor. 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 Do that 100 times. That takes three minutes in the morning. And then I suggest repeating it again before you go to bed. It will change you at depth. You'll start to come to a realization of your oneness with God. The promises of Scripture are not mere pious hopes or guesses. They're more than sentimental words to be printed on devotional cards for Sunday school children. They are eternal truth, and they're true, and there is no perhaps about them. They're true for you today. In Psalms 5, verse 12, it says, Surely, O God, you bless the righteous. You surround them with your favor as a shield. My friend, God blesses and protects you, and God loves to do so. God loves to put you in God's favor, and that is a promise that you can depend on. You do your part by living in accordance with God's teachings. God will certainly do God's part by showering you with blessings in this world daily, making your life full of God's favor. Do you sincerely believe that God is on your side? Well, when you remind yourself that you are in God's favor, You'll be on God's side. Do you trust God when God promises to love you and protect you? Are you willing to seek God's guidance and follow God's lead wherever it may take you? Well, if you answer these questions with a clear and a resounding yes, then your heavenly God will surround you and infill you with God's favor. And it will be your shield against negativity. And inside of yourself, your shield against yourself, your worries and your your self-imposed limitations. God will bless you and keep you now and forever, just as God has promised.